A rousing track gallop between two of the main fancies in Tuesday's Melbourne Cup, Marmelo and Magic Circle, has turned heads out here this morning at Werribee. Hugh Bowman partnered Marmelo as he did 12 months ago going into the Melbourne Cup. He thinks this horse is going better. Meanwhile, Corey Brown on Magic Circle holds just one query. I was a lot happier with him this morning. He um, was a lot sharper. Uh, the other morning, he was very flat-footed getting around the turn. So. This morning he was a lot brighter, a um, lot more up underneath me in the bridle and um, yeah, happy with the way he did work. But I've got a little bit of a query with the weight. Um, I would have loved a, a lighter weight on his back, but he's definitely the right horse to do it. He's, he, he's a tough um, tradesman like Steyer and yeah, I'm really happy to be riding him. Meanwhile, Marmello looks in really good order going into the Melbourne Cup. He just shaded Magic Circle over the concluding stages of their gallop this morning and Hugh Bowman's really pleased to be partnering him again this year. I was very pleased with it, uh, worked alongside the same horse he worked with last week. They did a bit more this morning, so yeah, look, I, I was very pleased with how he felt. He, I felt he had a nice bit in hand, so yeah, he's going well, he's ticking over nicely. He's a bit stronger this year, there's no doubt about that, so more mature. Obviously last year he was four, this year he's five, so the horse appears to have travelled over very well. I know that uh, Huey's very happy with him. So, you know, all the signs are good, but I guess the reality is we're not going to know until after the race, are we? It's well documented that Huey wasn't so keen on running last year in the Caulfield Cup, but the decision was made to, to run him and he ran very well, which gave us all a lot of confidence, including the public going to the Melbourne Cup because he did start favourite. Uh, but obviously he didn't run as well in the Melbourne Cup as he did the Caulfield Cup. So. I guess for me, I take comfort in knowing that he's been over here already and travelled well, and I know what he's, you know, he, I know he's capable of performing fresh off the plane. I guess had he have not done that, it'd be another question mark. But you know, I guess having not seen him race over here, you're sort of hoping that he's travelled well. But all the signs suggest that he has, and he feels good to me, and that's all I can really go on.